During such events as a pyroclastic flow, complete human forms can often be preserved in a fixed position, turned to ash in an instant. Someone turning into a stone fossil with age, however, was thought to be an impossible scenario. That was until 1898, when an extremely controversial discovery was made deep within a copper mine. Although several reports have surfaced over the years of this most peculiar of discoveries, only one has ever managed to stay around long enough to be officially documented. Deep within an old copper mine in Chukikamata, an ancient stone woman, complete with basket and tools, was discovered. And although a date of only 400 years was preliminarily given, it is clear to the many involved that she is far older than that. The discovery was examined closely by Jose Torobino Medina, a central figure in Chilean archaeology at the time. He described his findings as follows. The body is that of a female. The depth of the soil where the corpse was found was no more than 6 to 8 feet, and the miner was probably searching the mountain when a sudden collapse buried her. The miner, feeling that the mountain was breaking down, lifted her arms up to protect her head the position in which her body is preserved. This discovery, although the only one of its kind, is highly controversial, and we suspect this may be because certain individuals are aware of its true antiquity. Beside the body were the remains of a basket, a stone sledgehammer, several stone shovels, sharpened pieces of wood, and a torn bag made of animal hide all leading to the conclusion that this mummy dates from a very distant time within our history. After more recent analysis was conducted, it was discovered that it was actually a man, strangely. He also has an unusually shaped skull, and a green hue from sulfate and chloride within the copper. It is thought this may have been one of the contributing factors in his marvelous preservation. The copper man of Chukwikamata is extremely difficult to research. And, although he is clearly of considerable historical importance, his whereabouts may continue to remain vague. Regardless of his known whereabouts, his existence will forever lend credence to a forbidden history here on our planet.